Hi, it's uh, me, it's Keith Lemon from television, from dreams, some, pe some people's dreams. Um, so today I'm going to do a little bit of um, drawing. Um, I'm doing it on my iPad. I'm doing it on the app um, Procreate. Uh, so let's do this thing. Let's um, let's go into hyperdrive and um, do time time lapse thing because it'll take ages. All right then, I'm gonna go to time lapse now. So um, when I'm drawing on Procreate, it's basically made up of different layers. Let's imagine um, thin um, transparencies, um, if you've never used it before. Um, I will normally do a very graphic style drawing, um, all in black, very graphically sort of comic book style drawing. And then I will add color. The color layer will go underneath, if you can imagine that as transparencies. Um, and then I merge them down together as one object that you can move around the page. That was interesting, wasn't it? I'll tell you what else is interesting. I'm just thinking, can you imagine if um, Pharrell had his own talk show? A lot of people have got um, podcasts now. I'd like, I'd like to see Pharrell um, have his own talk show. Yeah. I'm Pharrell and welcome to Pharrell For Real. Today I'm talking to one of my heroes. You might know him as Rocky, you might know him as yeah, Rambo. Uh, his real name is Sylvester Stallone and I just want to ask him, how is he getting into character? Oh, he's not mic'd up, you'll have to speak into this. How do you get into character? Yeah, well, I can't actually tell what he's saying. Join me next time when I'll be speaking to someone who can actually speak. F off and good night. <laughs> that was a bit of fun, wasn't it? Okay, let's get back to drawing. So I've, um, I've done my sort of line drawing, I don't know if you can see, can you see, can you see, I don't know if you can see, it's there, it's there. Um, it's a very cartoony cross hatchy style and um, I'm starting to get bored, so normally when I get bored I just stop drawing. Um, I'm going to stop drawing, I'm going to colour it in now, but before I do that I'm off for a pee, so I'll just go for a pee. Having a wee. Excuse me. Just noticed I've got a same top on as I have a wallpaper. A little bit of an Austin Powers wee there. I want to, oh. But my plan is to move into the house the next time they leave their door open. I'm just going to zoom in, I'm going to run up to the highest point in the house that'll be the loft, uh, and I'm going to do like chats and stuff hopefully because um, I've got a little bit of tech I've got a phone and, and and then I can speak to some of the the people that I used to know back in the day when I was on the telly and stuff via the medium of the house parties the FaceTimeies all that sort of stuff that's what I'm gonna do yeah is he inside doing his drawings oh, such a tit I just had me sweet wee. Um, right, let's colour him in. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> 
And there you have it. Um, it's Billy from. Um, you can see the reflection of the light there, can't you? Billy from Gremlins, aka Zach Gallagher. Let's have a full screen of that. You can't see it on the iPad. So um, I met um, Zach Gallagher on. Where's our meeting? The first time I met him was at um, a screening of Gremlins at Prince Charles Cinema. I was quite nervous to meet him because um, I grew up with Gremlins. It was one of my favourite films. I can remember going to see it with my gran and I wasn't old enough to go see it. Um, I had Wellington boots filled with newspaper to make me look taller so I could get in because it was a 15 and I wasn't 15. I wobbled in like a, a drunk child. And uh, so I was quite nervous to meet him and I met him, he's a lovely fella, he came on Celebrity Juice and um, he also came on the Keith and Paddy Picture Show when we did Gremlins as our Christmas special. Action. This is us filming it, um, no, here he is, I there he is. I guys, but we may have outdone the original. Yeah, oh, well, hang on a minute, right. Gizmo was in a remote control car. Yeah. How was he controlling it then? Probably best not to overthink it, don't you? Yeah, let's not overthink it. Oh, he didn't have his coat on at end either, did he? Taking it off. Oh, he had a ripped jumper. It's still good, though. Oh, and yeah. This is actual footage from his phone. Just listen to him getting all excited about our set. And there's the reproduction. Look at that. That's pretty good. One more time. That. And that. That. And that. Okay. Well, that's it for today. Um, I'll do some more stuff um, another day. Um, hopefully, when lockdown um, isn't happening, I don't know if I'm looking into the, the right zone. Uh, after lockdown, we'll have some guests on this YouTube channel thing, and um, I'll be chatting to them. Um, I know that Patsy Kensett said she'll watch Lethal Weapon 2 with me, so we'll film that as well. So if I don't see you for a week, I'll see you for a window. And um, that's it. Look after yourself. All best. I'll just move out of frame. Yeah, that's smooth. But now I'm going to have to turn it off. See ya. Or subscribe and whatever. I don't know what you say.